Welcome back or welcome if you're new here. My name is Josie and I'm a wife and stay-at-home mom to one beautiful baby girl. And on my channel, I do a ton of cleaning, cooking, DIYs, decorating, makeovers, especially now that we recently moved into this home. So today, guys, this video is going to be a short, sweet, but enjoyable one. Or at least, I hope so. It's really just kind of catching you guys up on the changes I did after the kitchen makeover. If you're new here, I recently did a little makeover on my kitchen where I added open shelving. I changed some cabinet doors to the glass ones and I added a pendant light and added some new decor and I just wasn't crazy about how the decor turned out so we're going to be redecorating that in today's video and just updating you guys I bought some new stuff and then we're also going to be decorating in the upstairs hallway again so this video is kind of a part two for both the video where I decorated in my upstairs hallway and then the kitchen makeover because I told you guys I wanted to do some things at the end of those videos that I wasn't satisfied with and so I'm doing those things in today's video so after we go ahead and finish up in here i'm gonna take everything off the counters and we're gonna do some rearranging and adding a new decor where you wanna go i am all about adventure times another drink and i'll go anywhere the way you smile like a flash in the So here again, I'm just rearranging. I moved the coffee maker. I moved uh, quite a few things actually. And then I'm also going to be doing some rearranging with the open shelvings, pulling stuff from there that I thought looked better on the countertops and then placing it with other things. And yeah, and then when we get to the island, I'll be putting all the new stuff that I got from Target there. And I am totally happy with how this look came out compared to the previous look. And definitely let me know what you guys think if you did see my previous video. Special, I'm sure everything makes total sense when you're next to me. The last few things I did was move this fruit bowl, which was in the center of the island there, and then I completely took out the little stand I had with the salt and pepper shakers and just combined it with where I had the oils because I just felt like it was too much. I also took out the cutting board that had the cooking book on it the Chrissy Teigen cooking book and I used it in the center of the island as well I've always wanted to try some of this I got this at Target you guys on clearance for no I'm lying not on clearance um it was like a 15% off hearth and hand so I think I got it for like 12 bucks it's originally 15 and then I did buy more of these so I finally found the name of it in Hobby Lobby and I have it linked down below but it's called Wild Asparagus. I've been in love with this greenery. You guys seen I put it by my dining table. It's just I I'm, this is the new look that I'm going for for greenery is that like natural looking green. I just don't like the like two bright green ones anymore this candle i also got on clearance um from the hearth and hand section it was like seven dollars it's originally twenty dollars and then i'm finally replacing these hard white light bulbs to the clear teardrop ones that i told you guys i wanted to get and you're gonna see i didn't screw them all the way in because they're just too bright for me so i'm actually gonna have my husband make it its own like um, its own light switch so that when I turn on the rest of the lights that doesn't turn on as well um, so hopefully you can get that done but yeah I love the way it turned out it just finished off the kitchen so I'm just wiping down the countertops now I know I did this kind of backwards and then I'm going to quickly make a cinnamon cake with you guys I love this brand to put inside of the cake stand
Take a chance for some romance. Don't copy your eyes. We'll love trees. Know you better than anyone else. It's time you let your guard down for someone like me. I'd say I'm settled. Not me, then someone like me that knows what to do and how to take care of you. But most of all, that deserves you. The sweetest red sheet. So now we're going to be doing some rearranging in the upstairs hallway, starting off with replacing these candlesticks and that black vase along with those florals. I told you guys I wanted to try the greenery that I just put downstairs up here as well. So I went ahead and got that. I also got a new vase and taper candle holders from Target on clearance. Um, this was like 6 bucks. I found it in the clearance end cap and I have these things linked below but for some reason they're showing regular price on Target so if you can see that they have them in store I would go in store um, because they're definitely all on clearance and then I also found this vase it's from Threshold I believe Studio McGee and I got it for seven bucks you guys so it was a steal and then I just added the same greenery that I am totally obsessed with and I love the way it turned out Deserves you. That he deserves you. Last thing we're gonna be doing that was a whole mission, really. My husband had to get his ladder from the garage and everything was putting a picture frame here. I went to Hobby Lobby and I found this for half off, so I decided it's way bigger than the other ones from my previous video. And I told you guys I did want to put something above the staircase, but this is just temporary for now until we can find something a little more filling. But my husband went ahead and put it up for me when he got home, and that's the last thing that we're going to be decorating in today's video. So then after this, I'm just going to be showing you guys some end shots. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until now, please let me know if you liked everything that I rearranged and redecorated or if you like the original look better or as always if you have some suggestions I know some of you guys have some natural tapestry above this staircase or some large canvases I'm thinking of putting another canvas on top of that or replacing it with a family photo once we take like professional family photos but anyways Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one, God willing, as always.